The Health Economics Policy and Management course is an executive course run over two years aimed at mid-career students trying to skill themselves for future career development. We structured the programme to allow people to continue their careers. The programme itself attempts to both give them an idea of how health systems operate as well as to give them tools to analyse the healthcare system, also to give them a way to assess uh, through economic analysis and quantitative analysis how their healthcare systems are performing. It runs from December for four teaching sessions that are two-week sessions in December, June, with a dissertation due at the end of the second year in November. During the on-campus times, that's when the teaching is done, covering a course a week. In the in-between is the pre-sessional reading for the next module and the assignments from the module that has just followed. In the first year, we have four compulsory courses, health economics and healthcare financing, resource allocation, which is a cost effectiveness course, and introduction to healthcare management, which will give students all of the foundational information that they need around management in healthcare. In the second year, students have a broad range of choices, more detailed courses on how to do an economic evaluation with different types of data, how that information can be used in healthcare technology assessments, but also on the management side, implementation of different management techniques in hospitals to improve quality and safety, as well as a case-based study course that goes into healthcare strategy called Health Administration and Management. On the health policy side, there's other courses from the more macro to the more micro level, looking at health systems, performance assessment, so a wide range of courses to pick and choose depending on what they're interested in and what they're looking to get from the degree. Students have a range of experience. Some come in with four to five years. We've had other people who have 20 years experience and are senior management at their organization. On average, I'd say people probably have around 10 years experience, and that makes for a really diverse range of experiences from many different sectors and adds to the diversity of our student body. We get clinicians as well as healthcare managers or people from the pharmaceutical sector, and they're quite interested in either acquiring skills to allow them to assess treatments or individual programs within the healthcare sector and or to skill up on their management aspects to move further on into management within the healthcare system. Either through teaching on the course or through guest lectures, there's the opportunity to learn from key thinkers in health economics, health policy and management, but also the opportunity to interact with stakeholders who are directly applying the theories that they're learning in the classroom.